The Agriculture Department has finally confirmed what has been causing hog deaths in the country. And it's what authorities have been suspecting all along. Shaila Francisco tells us more. The Agriculture Department confirms it's the African swine fever that killed pigs in some areas of Rizal and Bulacan. According to the department, 14 out of the 20 blood samples sent to the UK tested positive for the virus. The A Acting Secretary William Dorr also identified seven areas that were affected by the African swine fever. These are San Jose, Macabod, Mascap, San Isidro and San Rafael in Rodriguez Rizal, Kupang in Antipolo Rizal, and Giginto in Bulacan. Recall that during the department's budget hearing on Friday, Dar told lawmakers that they're currently monitoring other areas in Region 3 or Central Luzon. Earlier affected barangays, the report we have gathered is they have been properly managed, contained, and controlled. There are just few areas now that have uh, abnormal deaths, we call it, or in, in increase in the deaths of the uh, hogs, and these are now being handled somewhere in Region 3. The Bureau of Animal Industry also said that it had already disinfected supposed affected areas last week. Doon po sa affected areas initially, dito po sa bandang Rizal, pagkakalam ko po tapos na po lahat. Yung initial phase ng uh, crucial control measures ay natapos natin yun. Yung buntot niya, yun ang babantayan natin ngayon sa lugar na yun at sa ibang lugar din. Kaya may surveillance tayo. For now, food safety and quarantine measures are still being implemented to make sure that the disease does not spread. One of which is the implementation of stricter guidelines for slaughterhouses. These facilities are given 10 hours to slaughter hogs. After that, there's a 6-hour disinfection period. They shouldn't allow additional slaughters beyond the period, especially while the place is being sanitized. But meat dealers are worried that this regulation could drag their income. Sa amin po, kailangan po talaga yung pahabol. Kasi uh, most likely yung mga late workers tapos yung mga uh, ibang catering canteens, mga kumukuha po na sinusuplayan namin, mas gusto po nila ng fresh meat. Or uh, minsan din po um, yung ibang tao kasi mas gusto din nila yung bagong katay. Malaki pong um, adjustment na naman po to sa amin kasi katatapos lang po ng issue tapos ganito po yung ano ulit, within na uh, hindi pa kami na pag naabisuhan. Malaking kalugihan yon, pati mga meat dealers kasi uh, marami nagpapahabol kasi sa morning doon nila nalalaman kung kulang pa yung titinda nila sa palengke o hindi. Um, kaya lang, um, magand, um, anong kasi magandang step din ito dahil para ma-prevent natin yung kasi nagkakaroon ng disinfection. Some LGUs are also asking the department to notify them immediately once the disease has infiltrated their area. Nahirapan kami doon. Um, kailangan namin talaga may updates kami para aware kami kung saan ang dapat namin kukontrolin. Shaila Francisco, we are One News.